Hello guys and welcome to Tactical Gear Review Channel. Today I want to show you the Defender Pan from First Tactical, which I use often in my range, in my training, and when I'm on duty, and when I have to wear a combat uh, vest, plate carrier. A really nice, uh, rigid pants. Um, not so breathable, not so good for summer, but I prefer to sweat uh, than uh, to be with a torn uh, pants. So really a uh, rigid, nice fabric, hard fabric, um, and really nice uh, pants, Defender pants from First Tactical. Let's begin the review. <laughs> So here are our first tactical pants. I want to say before I start the review, this they have this is a really heavy duty pants. They have really nice durable fabric, though they are not suitable uh, for summer to hot in them, and they are not stretchable, which may uh, be a big cons. So let's start our review. So here we have one button here and also one button inside to prevent uh, an opening have a zipper here, first tactical zipper, not YKK zipper, and the fabric here to protect your uh, groin area. What I really like about first tactical, they have these white tags for your ID or your name, so no one will um, take your pants. I have here uh, the pants, as you can see, the fabric is 55 cotton and 45 cordura nylon, and uh, that's the fabric here. So as I said, really nice uh, rigid fabric, but not stretchable and hot. So they are heavy duty, made for really hard missions, but for me, they are not so comfortable because they live in a really hot uh, country uh, here in Israel. But the things I like about these pants, they have plenty of pockets. So firstly, you have these pockets, your regular pockets really deep inside as you can see my hands go here this is the end of the pocket really big one this is what it's made from inside you have a hole for uh, to your water to go out and also for some ventilation you have a small pocket here for small things so the pockets are not really duplicated though you have here one small pocket too but here at the upper side you have such small thing i don't know what they use it for i think for the first tactical knife uh, they may use that pocket or for something else you have here for also one front, small front pocket like this this is the pocket and bigger pockets which i use for my phone or for my magazines so it's really really deep till here also the same uh, the same side over this one you have a nice side cargo pockets on the zipper so as we can see here you can see the ykk zipper so really nice big pocket with a fabric here to be expandable in uh, and inside you have really nice um pockets two sections sorry you have a lot of sections though so i think that many of the guys and the military they never use such, such sections because it's really hard to find things inside so i really never use them so may maybe for if for you this is a really nice feature this amount of section please write in the comments i would like to know also nice a small uh, hook here to attach your keys or some other gear the same thing you have on this side uh, side of course sections and the hook you have really nice big belt loops here for your military belt at the back here you don't have any reinforcement on your S area <laughs> on your back area you have big pockets till here with a tiny fabric 
at your back with the zippers also. So, as you can see, the first tactical logo. What I like about first tactical, they know that the pants may be uh, hot, so they make holes like this here and also in the groin area to provide more ventilation and a really nice here uh, reinforced groin area with really hard, nice stitches as you can see here really good but not see not stretchable like helicon takes or 511 pants still i think they will hold better in heavy duty conditions than the helicon takes or 511 pants just not for not they're not su suitable for uh, my work most of the time here also you have the knee uh, area which is you have the double double there and also you can you have here as you can see inside you have a fabric so you can open this to have more ventilation to your legs and also you can put here the, fi the first tactical uh, knee protection as you can see also from inside they have a harder fabric here to provide uh, more durability to this upper layer so this is really really nice um, at the bottom here, from the left and the right side, you have small packets for your cat tourniquet kit or for your first first aid uh, kit. Also, uh, this was a nice feature. Many uh, military men use this, but uh, in time we uh, moved the kits from here to our combat belt because it's not uh, so uh, nice to run with kits here on your ankle, not so comfortable. And at the bottom here you have really nice elastic bandage to adjust the pants on your boots so no insects or mud or sand will go inside. So guys, as I said, really uh, heavy duty First tactical pants, I told you before, if you saw my um, video about uh, the first tactical Defender uh, combat shirt, the combat shirt is really, really nice with nice uh, stretchable fabric. I would like to see first tactical putting this fabric like here on the crotch area, groin area, uh, and maybe uh, here at this. And if you, they, they put a stretchable fabric here at the back and in the groin area, I think these pants will be really great because they will be heavy duty and also stretchable and more ventilated. So that's it guys. If you like this video, please push the like button, comment below, subscribe to my channel and of course share this video with your friends. And if you would like to support me, you can do it on Patreon. I will really appreciate it. Thank you.